Hello, my name is Mr. Casares. I am the band director of Lenore High School, and this is your tutorial to how to clean your saxophone. There's a few things that you need. You're gonna have, need a toothbrush, a cleaning swab, some a towel, small towel and some paper towel. So now what we're gonna do is we're going to open the saxophone. So we're gonna remember that this, the latches are always gonna be going, going towards up. So you put them down and then you open the case. And then of course you're gonna have your saxophone already put away like this. Um, this is my personal saxophone. So what I'm gonna suggest you guys to do first is take out the mouthpiece. Take out the mouthpiece and then take out the case covering. Of course, you're going to have the ligature out, so untwist it, take it apart, take it out, and put it on the side. Do not worry about uh, those two. Do not wet the ligature because this will get rusty if you put it on water. So now that you have your mouthpiece, um, this is where you're going to um, do majority of the cleaning so this is going to be the thing that you're going to have with the toothbrush the toothbrush as well as uh, any brush that you have okay so now we're going to use the neck and we're going to clean it so the way the neck it, it, it's pretty much two ends of course this one being the end that goes in the body uh, but what we're going to do is after you play it and you want to clean it um what you want to do is you want to grab a small paper towel like this just a small sheet and it can be any paper towel um, I do recommend um, something just a little bit strong um, do not use cloth and do not use this because it will get stuck in here okay for tenors or or altos do not use it same thing with baritone saxophone do not use that as well uh, it will get stuck Okay, so now that we have our neck and our paper, what we're gonna do is we're going to fold it and we're gonna turn it like this so that it becomes a little bit of, of um, kind of like a, a little snake. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn and insert it into the, into the neck. So I am turning and pushing, turning and pushing, turning and pushing, turning and pushing. So slowly turn and push, turn and push. Keep going. Turn and push. There's going to be a point in where there is, it's going to exit through the other end. And it's gonna happen right now, see? Turn point, turn the point. This works best when you do it after you play. So once you do that and see how it's at the end, make sure that you continue doing it until you can't no more. Until it's all the way there. Once that happens, you grab this end, you grab this end, and then you just slowly pull. You slowly pull and you're gonna have a lot of gunk and a lot of stuff that is coming out. Please throw away this, throw it away, put it on the side. And that's it for that. You can also do it again from the opposite way. So what we're gonna do is do it the opposite way. Grab another clean one. You're gonna do it from the corner. You're gonna twist it, twist, twist, twist twist until you have a little bit of a snake ish okay and then you're going to insert it okay same thing twist and turn twist and turn keep going until it comes out here don't push it make sure that you twist and turn all the way until you're on the opposite side so you're almost done do not completely push it now that you have this all you gotta do is just slowly 
slowly just do that and boom it's out this again this is going to be a lot of gunk as well because you're cleaning it both from front and from the uh, from the back and from the front so make sure that you have this throw it away and then you have yourself clean what you can also do is you can also grab your brush and you can just kind of just let the rest of the gunk that's right there just scoop. and then same thing here just go there brush it out and all you gotta do just shake it out a little bit if there's some stuff in there that's it and that should be clean enough okay now we're gonna take the instrument out of the case and just be careful to not use one hand, one hand only. Use both hands. So you're gonna take it out, both hands, and then you're going to hold it from the bottom, hold it from the body as well. There's this little knob up here. This is for so like moisture doesn't go into your your instrument for when you have it in there. So what happens is you're gonna take this off, put it, make sure that you have it secure. Your knees here as well. Put it, make sure you have your hand. Take it out and put it in the case. Do not lose it. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and use the string and, and, and the little weight with the cloth at the end. And we're actually going to put it inside of the small opening. All the way through, all the way through. All the string has to go through until you're here in there and then you're gonna just push in just a little bit once that happens you're gonna grab both hands and you're gonna lean it forward be careful that there's nothing that will hit it then after that you're gonna uh, pretty much hug it and then just pull slowly pull slowly do not put too much force into it until all the, the spit comes out once that happens, we're gonna do it again, but we're gonna do it the other way. So, we're gonna grab it, the weight, put it in there. The whole string goes in there. Okay. Then both hands, you're gonna lean it. Be, be careful not to hit anything. Forward, lean it forward. Shake it a little bit until it comes out of this end. Now, you're gonna hold it your arm, tug it in, slowly pull it out, pull out, pull it out, pull it out, until it comes up. Then after that, you can just put it away, grab your little knob, put it in here, close it up, both hands, and back into the case. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is clean the mouthpiece. The mouthpiece is probably one of the most uh, important things to clean. So be sure that you do this thoroughly. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna run some hot water, some hot water in it, and then allow it to get warm for a little bit. And then you can still rinse it a little bit in here. Um, the warm water is better for this because um, it allows it the gunk to get out as uh, uh, detached from the mouthpiece as, as possible. So right now it's getting it's getting a little warmer. Okay, it's getting a little warmer. So once that happens, what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab your brush, your toothbrush, and you're just going to start brushing away. Okay, brush away, brush away inside from both sides. Okay, from both sides. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna have, uh, you're gonna get some hand soap. You don't really have to have any, a specific soap. Hand soap is fine. Uh, go ahead and just wait there. Put it in there. Put it around the mouthpiece, inside. And then of course, a little bit of water. Turn it off. Do it again. This. Do this. Do it on the side. Like that. From up here too as well. There. And then you 
just going to finish, rinse it up, on the side, rinse it up, right there. Just be careful that it can be a little too hot. So, after you're done with that, and shake it. And you're going to grab your towel, dry it up. everything make sure that you have your instrument inside your neck is here your neck strap your reed your cleaning supplies make sure you put it away cleaning supplies here like that there make sure that your mouthpiece is back with your ligature and back with your ligature And your cap. Put it in there. Right there. Set up. 